Hi, um, in this question we are being told that there are only red marbles and green marbles in a bag. There are three red marbles and five green marbles. So I've just drawn a diagram of what's going on over here. Nicky takes at random a marble from the bag. He does not put the marble back in the bag. Now that's important. Nicky takes at random a second marble from the bag. And we now need to complete the probability tree diagram. So let's have a think. So um, the probability of him picking a red marble at the start is going to be 3 eighths. Therefore the probability of him picking a green marble, well there's 5 of them, so that's going to be 5 eighths. Okay, now let's see what happens. Let's see that if we go down this branch here, so we're now considering what happens after he's taken a red marble. Now remember, if he takes a red marble, it comes out of the bag and he doesn't put it back in, which means that there's only seven left. Two of them are now red, so the probability of him now picking a red is going to be two sevenths. The probability of him now picking a green, well there's still five of them out of seven, so it's going to be five sevenths. Okay, so that's that one scenario. But let's say, rather than picking a red, he picked a green. So I now need to take a green one out, and we need to consider the probabilities. Well, if he took a green out, the probability of him now picking a red, there's three reds out of seven of these marbles altogether, so that's now going to be three sevenths. And the probability of him picking a green, there's four out of the seven altogether, so that's going to be four sevenths. Okay, so... Um, that's the first part, we've completed the probability tree diagram with these probabilities um, here. Part B says work out the probability that Nicky takes marbles of different colours. So in order for him to take marbles of different colours, it's either going to be red, green, so we can write that as the probability of red and then green, or green, red. The probability of green and red. So let's work out what these probabilities are. Remember, um, if I've got a red and a green, I'm going to multiply the probabilities together. So I'm going to multiply these fractions together. So I'm going to do 3 eighths times by 5 sevenths to work this out. So 3 eighths times by 5 sevenths, I multiply the numerators together, which is 15 and the denominator together, so 8 times 7 is 56. Okay, so for green followed by red, I've got 5 eighths times by 3 sevenths, so again that's going to be 15, and 8 times 7 is 56. So, the probability that Nikki takes marbles of different colours um, they're the only two scenarios, and we're going to add those together. So we're going to do 15, 56, plus 15, 56, and that's going to give me 30, 56. I can simplify this, um, but I'm not being asked to, so I'm just going to write it down as 30, 56. Okay, I hope that makes sense. I'll see you next time.